Welcome everybody, how are you? In this video, we will talk about an important math concept called derivative of logarithmic function, such that y equal in x. Want to find the derivative of this function, we can write x in the numerator and the derivative about x equal 1. So the derivative of this function will be 1 over x. Again, we can write this function in the numerator here and the derivative about this function will be 1. Then the derivative about logarithmic function y equal logarithmic x, then the result will be 1 over x. And what about y equal ln x power 2? We know y dash meaning derivative about y. We can write this uh, function here in the numerator x power 2 and derivative about x power 2 equal to x. And we can sample set x divided x equal 1, x power 2 divided x equal x then the derivative out about this function will be 2 over x. Another example, y equal ln x bar 3, we want to find the derivative, derivative about this function. We can write x bar 3 in the numerator and derivative about x bar 3 equal 3 x bar 2. And we can uh, sample it by dividing x bar 2 in the numerator and the numerator. So the result will be 3 over x because x bar 2 divided x bar 2 equal 1. x bar 3 divided by x bar 2 equal x. Another example, y equal ln x bar 2 plus 4, we want to find derivative about the logarithmic function. We can write this expression in the numerator and derivative about this expression, x bar 2 derivative about this um, term will be 2x. We must drop the power here behind x and subtract 1 from the power. So the result will be 2x over x bar 2 plus 4. What about this example? y equal ln 5x plus 5 subtract x bar 4. We know y dash its meaning derivative about y. We can write this expression in the numerator here, and in the numerator we can find the derivative about this function. Derivative about 5x will be 5. The derivative about 5 equal be 0, and derivative about negative x bar 4 will be negative 4 x bar 3. We must drop the power behind x and subtract 1 from the power. So the result will be 5 subtract 4 x bar 3. Look at another example, y equal ln sine x. We know the derivative will be what we can write this function in the numerator sine x and derivative about it sine x will be cosine x. We know cosine x over sine x equal cotan x. Look at another example. What about if y equal ln seventh root of x? We can find the result by converting from this seventh root to x power 1 over 7 convert from 7th root to power such that then x power what 1 over 7 because x power 1 1 over 7 we can write it 1 over 7 so 7th root will be x power 1 over 7 we can convert to exponent power okay Okay, this rational exponent. We can find derivative of this function. We can write x power 1 over 7 here in the numerator. Okay, and we can find the derivative of this function, or we can drop 1 over 7 here outside and write in x. So we can write x in the numerator here and 1 over 7 outside and derivative about x will be 1 so the result will be 1 over 7 multiply 1 over x equal 1 over 7x okay again y equal ln 7th root of x equal y y equal ln x power 1 over 7 we can convert 7th root to rational exponent and we must drop 1 over 7 outside here and the result will be 7th ln x we can write 7 here 1 over 7 multiply x in the numerator and 1 in numerator 1 it is a derivative about x we can write x in the numerator and derivative about x will be 1 so 1 multiply 1 equal 1 and 7 multiply x equal 7x so the derivative will be 1 over 7x okay the solve. Look at this example y equal cube root the cube root of ln x. We know we can convert from cube root 
to power 1 over 3 this separation lane x it's function lane x to power lane to power 1 over 3 and we can find derivative of the function we can drop 1 over 3 here and write lin x subtract 1 from third third subtract 1 dot the derivative about lin x will be 1 over x it's the derivative about this function and we can sample it right y dash equal x multiply 3 equal 3x three and 1 over 3 subtract 1 it's meaning negative 2 over 3 lin x of to power negative 2 over 3 and we can drop this power from numerator and numerator and inverse the sign here it will be positive so y dash equal 3x multiply ln x power 2 over 3 and write 1 here this is the result about this example okay again Look at another example. I will talk it again. Solve it again. Okay. Be attention at this example. This example we know y equals the cube root of ln x. The cube root of ln x equals ln x power 1 over 3. We can find the derivative of this function. Drop third here and subtract 1 from third. The result will be negative 2 over 3. And we can find the derivative of this function 1 over x behind it. Again, drop the power here and subtract 1 from the power. And then we can find the derivative of this function ln x equal 1 over x. We can write the function x here in the numerator and derivative about x will be 1. So we can find the result 1 uh, over 3 subtract 1 equal negative 2 over 3. We can convert this uh, uh, this term ln x power negative 2 th over 3 from numerator to numerator and convert the sign here from negative to be positive. Okay. So the result will be 1 over 3x ln x power 2 over 3. Look at this example. What about y equal rhythmic x for the b3? You can find the derivative. About x will be 1. And write x here dot len this number, len 3. It's okay. This is the derivative about this function. Another example, what about y equal natural logarithmic about logarithmic x power 2 and the base 4. We can drop 4 power here. So y equal to natural logarithmic x for the base 4. And we can find the derivative about this function. We can write 2 outside here and write x in the numerator and derivative about x will be 1 and write lam what then this natural number four so the result will be y dash equal two times one equal two over x dot len four y equal logarithmic separation five subtract two x to the base seven we can find the derivative of the function. We must this expression write in the numerator here, and we can write the derivative of this expression will be negative two, and we can write here then about this number seven. So the result will be negative two over five minus uh, two x dot ln seven, and we can write this expression in brackets. Okay.